Hi guys, my name is Kimora. Welcome back. If you are new, welcome. Today we'll be talking about air purifiers. So I'm pretty sure you clicked on this video because you are one, struggling with lingering odors, or you're struggling with dust, you may have allergies, you might just be struggling with life overall, but one day at a time. So today we'll be talking about how to get rid of lingering odors and like dust and all those things. So this video idea came about because I was recently having a conversation with one of my friends. We started out by talking about humidity and we were talking about hygrometers and we ended up somehow talking about air purifiers. I thought to myself, maybe I should just share my opinion or share my take on the one that I currently own. The air purifier in question is by Winix and it is the 5500-2 model. I'd like to say there are two models. Matter of fact, there are multiple models, but I'll mention two and expound really on one. There is another model that's pretty similar to this one. That model is the 5300-2. Further on, I'll tell you why I chose this model as opposed to that one. So I bought this air purifier in September of 2020. So I've had it for three solid years now and I must say that I have no regrets. This is a very, very efficient model and it is budget friendly as well. I chose this model not only for the fact that it was cost effective, but what stood out to me the most was the carbon filter that was a part of this model. Now, in general, most air purifiers will have carbon filters included, but not all carbon filters are created equal. This model has three filters, and that's one of the things that stood out to me the most. It has a washable pre-filter that is made up of fine mesh that traps the larger dust particles that is present in your home, including hair. Like I saw my hair in this when I opened it up to clean it. So it does a pretty good job of trapping larger particles. The second filter is the washable carbon filter. Now, this is where you realize that not all carbon filters are created equal. This carbon filter is not just any carbon coated material. It actually has carbon pellets that actively filter gas particles like smoke and cooking odors. This is the primary reason for me getting this model, which is the 5500-2, as opposed to the 53-2. The last filter is the true HEPA filter. HEPA is an acronym for high efficiency particulate air. This filter will basically be the last filter to stop all the fine particles that pass through the other two filters. So, as I mentioned, the main reason for me getting this was to remove the cooking like odors and dust. So if you have like allergies or anything like that, that's where the HEPA filter portion of it comes in that will remove most of the particles that will affect you and the carbon filter is the one that will control like when you cook and the the oil particles that are dispersed in the air that's where that part comes in the carbon filter just in case you're new to the whole air purifiers and the terminologies that's what you want to focus on and that's why this particular model is such a good buy because there are more expensive filters that would quite likely do a better job if you look at like the HEPA filter portion or if you look at the carbon filter portion but combined this is like the most budget friendly based on my research and that's why I recommend this model as opposed to most of the other affordable ones because most of them will only have the carbon coated material as opposed to active carbon pellets in the filter system. This unit is ideal for a room size of up to 360 square feet. So we're looking at a medium to a large size room. What I find is that wherever I keep this air filter, I will dust less. And initially I didn't realize, but I truly believe that this helps attracting the dust to it as opposed to it just resting on like furniture and other surfaces. So that's also something that's very good. It, it really is effective in getting the dust to it. It has an air quality indicator that will show how poor 
or how good your air quality is. Blue is for good, orange is for fair, and red means that your air quality is poor. When the filters need to be replaced, the filter replacement indicator will illuminate. There's a little light that will come on and you know it's time to change your filter. Also, if you're a little lazy, say you have it in your room, it has a remote so you don't necessarily have to get out of bed to turn it on or to turn it off or to increase the fan speed. You could always use your remote. There are four fan speeds and the fourth one is the turbo mode. So you have low, medium, high and turbo. Turbo is my favorite because it's like white noise. It's, it's relatively loud. Some would say it's loud, but I personally, that's the mode I keep it on because I like the white noise that comes with it. I'm a light sleeper, so I really like having something to block out like the outdoor noise or just random noise in general. So I personally love it, but if you don't, you could always keep it on like the medium level or even low. It also has smart sensor to detect air quality. If you have it on the auto mode that it also has, it will basically adjust to filter your air accordingly. One of the cons to some people might be that you cannot turn off the lights that are on it unless you put it in sleep mode. So that's, and the sleep mode is like the quieter mode. It's the lowest fan speed. So I don't keep it on sleep mode. I really just put like something over it to cover the lights, but that's the only thing I realized that most of these, they don't have like a feature to remove the light. I keep this in my room at night, mainly because I want the white noise and also I want to filter my hair when I'm asleep. So yeah, I keep it personally, I keep it in my room and you can really keep it wherever you choose. I like to make sure I have it present when I'm cooking, just so, you know, I'm removing like the oils and the cooking smell that comes with preparing your meals. If you found this video helpful, please remember to like, subscribe, and share it with a friend or a family member. I really think this can be helpful to people who are struggling with allergies, if you're asthmatic, basically anything that has to do with having clean air present, this will be like a game changer for you. So remember, share it with someone you love, or buy one if you need it. You won't regret having one of these present in your home. I promise, like one of the best purchases I've made. And I told you it was affordable. It's about a hundred and something dollars. I leave the Amazon link below. If you want to check it out, feel free to Google it if you prefer. But yeah, if you want to buy it, you can use the link that is in the description bar. I hope you found this to be a quick overview. It was not an extensive review and I'd recommend you to check out a channel that I list below if you really want a more thorough review or a comparison between multiple air purifiers. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, bye.